Pitch diameter is the key equation for gears as it defines the radius and diameter where the mating of two gears occurs, which helps form your gear ratio. They look like this when you get done using a model. Those are the pitch radii from the pitch diameters. And here's all the formulas for them. All of them in millimeters using their common inch or millimeter standard input value. So this line will convert everything to pitch diameter in millimeters. So if we start out on our website and go to our calculator page, there's, uh, there's a lot of tools here for your use, but if we come down here to near the bottom, there's a diametral pitch calculator or pitch converter. And uh, you put one of these different units you might design with in here, it gives you the equivalent of all of them and all the other units. So let's put that in a spreadsheet and there they are. Um, and then all we have to do is change the tooth count or the helix angle. For the three first equations, they're spurs, that's the blue line. And for the second two, they're in red and they're helical. And once you're done, you can put these numbers as well as the outside diameters, which are in that spreadsheet, into your favorite CAD package. And now you have uh, those two tangent circles, your pitch diameters set up. And this also informs you on the center distance. This is a no backlash center distance. But this is super helpful for going into your physical model and building your gear case around these sets of uh, gears you just designed. This is a 53 tooth and a 23 tooth set of gears here. This is what they look like when you extrude them. And we'll just rotate them around so you can see their volume. So this is usually where you end up with in a design. We also have uh, gearcalculators.com where there's a much more formal and more much more fully featured set of design, inspection, and manufacturing calculations.